Hi everyone, I'm Jackie from Harvest Right. Today I'm going to show you how to freeze dry four different meals. What I love about this is that you can take any meal that you regularly eat at home and preserve it for later. You don't need any special recipe, you just take what you eat and put it in the freeze dryer. How great is that? Here we have chicken alfredo that I bought pre-prepared at the store, sloppy joe mix that I made at home, fresh garden vegetable stir fry with rice, and a frozen lasagna that I bought at the store. Let me get my trays and we'll get started. I'm going to take the chicken alfredo, scoop it onto the tray, and then spread it out until it's about a half inch thick. A good rule of thumb to follow is to fill the trays about a half inch thick. If the trays are too full, there will be too much moisture inside the freeze dryer to complete the freeze dry cycle. I'm going to follow this process for each meal. As you can see, I have my different meals on the trays. Each tray holds about four and a half to five cups of product. Even though the trays are only three quarters of an inch deep, they actually hold quite a bit of food. Now, let me explain something to you. If you do have a product that's taller than a half inch thick, such as lasagna, be sure not to fill the tray to capacity, leaving space around each serving. Now I'm gonna take these trays and put them in the freeze dryer. First, I'm gonna open the door. Then I'll place each tray on the rack. Now I'll take the insulation pad and place it inside. And close the door and latch it shut. I'm gonna push start. It'll remind me to close the drain valve I'll push continue, and then it starts. Now that everything's in, we'll come back when it's finished. Okay, I've taken our meals out of the freeze dryer. Look how great they look. All of the food has retained its size, shape, and color. In a matter of hours, pounds of food has turned into ounces. What I love about this is that you can break it into the serving sizes that you want for the number of people you want to feed. Throw it in a Mylar bag, with an oxygen absorbing packet, seal it up and date it, and it will store safely, retaining nearly all of its nutritional value for years. That's it for today. For more tips, check out the rest of our videos.